Great. shirt that I'm talking I about. Do. I mean, these things just keep going, folks. No, for real today, I, I think it was really, really cool just hearing the story. I'm really inspired by a lot of people that come on our show and how they're taking whatever they're doing and they're trying to give back in some way. And, you know, I, I really believe that we're living in a great day and age where people at least are aware. I don't think awareness is a solution, but I think awareness is the beginning of a solution. And we're seeing people that are aware. And I love what the Bible says in Romans chapter 10, verse 14. It says, how then can they call on the one they have not believed in? How can they believe in one whom they have not heard? And how can they hear without someone preaching to them? And how can they preach unless they are sent? As it is written, how beautiful are the feet of those who bring good news. And I love it when people step out and they really begin to try to touch people around them and try to do something beyond themselves. But, you know, the reality is, is this, is that people really don't care how much you know until they know how much you care. And I think some of these great things about getting clean water, we can't really preach good news to people if they're drinking dirty water. It's not going to be good news until at least we can give them clean water, take care of their basic needs where they can then hear the word of God. And so I'm really, really inspired as I hear so many different stories about guys taking their real estate businesses, guys taking music, whatever it is, to help people go further in life. And I would just challenge you wherever you're at. I think in 2012, there's so many different outlets that we can have that we can either give to, that we can serve into, that can really help people in an all-around way. The Bible says, how beautiful are the feet of those that bring good news. And sometimes good news is just a hot meal, clean water, helping people with their physical needs. Let's begin to start there. And then as we get there, I think we can begin to get the word of God, which as it sets into people's lives, it changes them forever. So I just want to pray for you today that you step out in faith, and that you too could be a blessing to someone around you. Lord, I thank you for those that are watching today, God. I thank you, Lay, Lord, for the great stories that we heard, Lord, the inspiration. Lord, I pray that, Lord, we wouldn't live, Lord Jesus, just in our comfortable world, but we would stretch, God, and we would step out into areas that are uncomfortable, that we might help those around us. Lord, we want to be people, God, that bring the good news to those that are less fortunate than us. Lord, today, we must take care of them, mind, body, and soul, every part of them, Jesus, we must care about. So I just pray, Lord, that we would be, Lord, stronger today from your word, God, that we would be challenged to do more. God, we love you and we praise you. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. And thank you so much for watching JCTV. Make sure you check out Leon McLaughlin at Clean Water Foundation. And I also want to give a shout out to our musical guest, Revolutionary, and featuring Uso. God bless. same person together we can rearrange the hurting it's time for change our stories are the same together we can do it together we will make history